Crabby Bill here, made it to camp. Vacation's about to begin. Just spent a couple of days with uh, the wife in North Wildwood, but now I'm up here at uh, Whitehaven, Pennsylvania. I'm gonna enjoy myself for five days. Got plenty of work to do. Got a little bit of lumber that was delivered there. I gotta make a trip tomorrow to uh, one of the local stores and pick up uh, cement and some other, uh, some other lumber, a couple other items I need. So I got a few projects. I got Jake the Fox going to be coming down, giving me a hand. Now checking out the pond. It's looking pretty good. Here's a frog in there barking at me. Water's kind of clear. I don't see any. Uh, I don't see any fish at this point here. But uh, I'm hopeful. I brought up that wash spray. I'm going to spray that tonight before I go to bed. And uh, see if I can uh, eradicate those wasps it's war we're going to war baby so so far everything here looks pretty good uh didn't even factor in the fact that i'm gonna have to cut the grass so i'm gonna call jake the fox see what time he's available to meet me in the morning run out to uh, the local store pick up uh, the supplies that we need and then spend the day working uh i think he said he's going to be available monday and tuesday so uh, I may even have work for him for Wednesday and Thursday if he wants. But happy to be here. Want to uh, unload the truck, get some stuff packed inside. There's a little bit of uh, drizzle coming down now. But uh, one of the things I need to do is to get that bunk room starting to straighten that up so I can get some bunk beds in there. We can uh, get some people up here for uh, guys weekend and then uh, see if we can get some people up here to hunt. So I'll check back in a little bit. Let the vacation begin. This is why I'm here. Absolutely beautiful out here tonight. Crabby Bill here. Guess who's with me today? Jake the Fox. Got Jake the Fox with me in the truck. Heading into Wilkesburg. Going to a uh, store to pick up uh, some additional lumber, a couple bags of cement. We need to put this fence up. Got some uh, pretty big clouds out there today. Hopefully we don't get too, uh, too wet while we're doing this. But what you got there for us, Jake? This could be interesting uh, on this uh, dog pen. It should be fun. In, so. Yeah, so far, uh, the mosquitoes look like they're going to be the problem. Uh, lots and lots of mosquitoes so far, but uh, somewhere in there I got some uh, bug spray, and uh, we're going to go from there. We're going to see what happens. Nice cool night last night. It's a little hot this morning. It's uh, should have a fun day. We'll check back.
It's on it, Mark, right? Yep. So that's so what you do is you come out four feet. Yeah. All right. Go out three feet. Okay. See so the mark where I made where you were just holding it? Mm -hmm. That's three feet. That marks four feet. So then when you run a tape measure from that corner mm -hmm. to this one here, that should be five feet. And that'll make this board straight. Okay. So that board's straight right now. All right. Yep. So that means that board's straight. It's going to hit the second tank. So we're going to have to cheat it in a little bit and have it not so straight so that it doesn't hit the tank. All right? Yep. Um, this is our line. So we're coming out no more than 16 feet from here to there. All right. So. Do me a favor, yep. uh, go down and move the second two by. Just pull it straight out. Okay. Bring that end over a little bit so it straightens it out. That's where we're going to want it. So I'm going to fish this one in right like that. How's that? Yep. How's that look from back there? It's a little bit over this way a little bit. Yeah, it's a little, it's a little in, but I, don't, I have to avoid that tank. Yeah. All right. Um, All right. From the cabin. We're going to lose too much, so we're going to try to make it straight to the eye, or make it look straight to the eye, so that we don't lose all this space over here, because we would be out to the end of the tape measure here, and then if we needed to get a truck in there for septic or whatever, it's not going to fit. We need to get the propane truck needs to be able to back in there. Septic truck might have to back in there. So I'm just going to make it straight to the eye and have it right there. I think that's plenty of room just so the dogs can come outside and go to the bathroom. That's all they need. All right, Jacob, what are you thinking? Even though I got, I got. What are you thinking, Jacob? Even though I got paint on my pants there. <gasps> uh, turn around for a second. He does have paint on his pants. You know why he has paint on it on his pants? Because I, I accidentally sat on it as I was uh, sat on the can of spray paint as I was measuring <laughs> the wood. <laughs> so, um, all right. So that's our layout. We're going to mark these posts now. Um, we'll get back to you when we're drilling these holes. That should be interesting. Okay, we got the first four holes dug. Uh, Jake's just taking the last uh, little bit out of there now. There was a big rock. Uh, he's trying to get that out of the way. But we got the uh, holes dug. We're just using this piece here as a guide. And uh, let's see how it's going to go. Check back in a couple of minutes. One, two, three, four. Four more to go. Okay, the first three, uh, technically four, I guess, are in. Uh, looks like they're straight. I hope they're straight. They look at the, they're in. They put concrete in them, and uh, I'm gonna let them set up for a little while. We're going to go over. And this is the real reason why and, uh, kill the wasp. I'm paying Jake the Fox 
to be my friend today. Yep. I'm going to use him as bait. He looks like he's a lot faster than I am. I am. I want him to go over there, and I want him to go over and stamp around in the spot where we think the wasp's nest, or as he corrected me, yellow jackets, which are wasps, are. And then we're going to spray them. But I want him to wait until I get out of the way. So get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Give me the damn can. I don't want you doing it. Your father won't ever let you down here again. Take the camera. All right. Oh, did you see the snake come out? Did you see? Did you catch the snake come out? I don't. Think, I, I don't know if I did or not. Hey, you know what? You got to show me where they're building the house too, bud. Oh yeah. I think we got them. Look. I think that's the spot. See some of them coming back to the hole? Mm-hmm. So, now that I know where the spot is, I'm going to hold on to the rest of these two cans. And then I'll spray them tonight. While they're in there. Because I think that's how it works, right? See, there's another one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're out right now feeding. So, oh, see? Oh. <laughs> it's not even funny. Maybe a little bit, but. It will be later. See them all coming back now? Oh, Let's yeah. get out of here. Yep. Keep it. Right. Here's your GoPro, you want it? <laughs> what's the matter with you? No, I'm good. You're not afraid of the wasp, are you? I am afraid. Uh, all right, I don't blame you. All right, what's the pond looking like anyway, folks? There, you can put that back where the other ones were. Mm -hmm. And uh, I guess, oh, did you hear the frog bark at us? At this point here, but I think we're going to uh, sit down and get something to drink. Right. And I guess uh, we got to get you something to eat, right? One clip must have fell off. We're missing one clip. We'll never find that. Got Jake the Fox working the camera there. See if he's better. See if he's any better than Krabby when she works it. Not that she's bad. Here's the other clip. Oh. Oh, oh there it is. Oh, Alright. We'll get some supplies. Alright. Okay. Alright. What did you say about my sandwich that I made you? It was delicious. And am I forcing you to say that? No, you're not. Okay. Now what? We're going to go back outside. Well, we are outside, but we're going to go out front and get those other uh, a couple posts in. Okay. And what else are you supposed to say? It was the best hamburger you've oh, ever had? Yes. It was, it was very... Hopefully the best hamburger ever. Okay. All right. You, <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm going to put this in my pocket. How's that? You know I'll never find it now. It's in there with my keys. And... 
what little money Krabby gives me. It's in there with that. So, what we're going to do here, then, is we're going to take a 4x4 four four, uh, fern strip. And that is level. Right there. That's level. So, I'm going to switch the bits out again. Put this fern strip there. And then we're going to take five. All right. Yep. You got that. Yep. Oh, my leg. Oh. All right. So the posts are in. They are not square. That they are to the eye, which is the same way I did the last fence, and it looked good because the lot is not square. And squaring off to the house, the corner, we wouldn't have enough once we move these rocks here. We wouldn't have enough if we had to get a truck back here to work on a septic or uh, there wouldn't be enough room there. So I don't want to, didn't want to come out any further with the fence. This is, uh, I think, going to be perfect for the dogs. Uh, <laughs> the butterfly bush is definitely going to have to get cut back. And uh, well, we'll see what happens here. Sun is blasting. Jake the Fox is working his butt off. Yep. Well, I'm only saying that because, you know, people are going to see this and they're going to think, eh, what was he doing sitting around nothing? I'm not going to say that he was sitting around doing nothing, but I mean, he helped a little bit. Yeah. So they look straight. And I just need to figure out how high I'm going to have it all the way around now. I'm not going to have it leveled off because it'll be over my head. I'm going to have it drop down uh, from that one that's there. I'm going to have it drop down. Uh, I only have the, th the metal fencing is three feet. So uh, I'm only going to have three feet to play with there. So, But the dogs won't jump over it anyway. We'll check back in a couple minutes. What do you got, Jake? What a day. What a day is right. Look, I got a wasp on it. Oh. Look, get out of it. There goes my glasses, again. Just knocked my own glasses off. All right, I survived that one, that attack. Running for my life. All right, well, the sun beat us down, but we're looking pretty good. Got our levels. Tomorrow we should fly right through it, go to Home Depot in the morning. I want to pick up, uh, I don't know, 10 or 15, maybe 20 bags of compost. I'm going to compost all that area there along the foundation walls. I'll go in there and weed whack it real well and then uh, compost it. We got the stones there to hold it back. I'll put some more stone in this area here. Uh, let this cement set up. We put the uh, top plate in. The bottoms are just there uh, so that we had our marks. We didn't lose our uh, 
our mark and where this was going to be. So Jake the Fox and Stab was just here checking on them. Apparently those guys can't hang. They didn't work as late as we did today, right? Yep. What, what was that you had to say about them? I forget well, now. Oh, uh, you forget what you were saying about them not being able to work all day like us mm -hmm. in the heat? Yeah. Only taking a 20-minute lunch break. So we're looking pretty good. Uh, I don't know, straight and all that kind of stuff to the eye. You can't put a square on it. can't put a real level on it because uh, it would be off eight inches if we tried to make it all level. So we split the difference. Uh, we made it so that it's somewhat pleasing to the eye. We're going to let this uh, set up. I'm going to go in and take a shower, get a cold beer, figure out what I'm having for dinner. And this guy here. See you guys tomorrow for uh, another hot day. 6 a.m., right? 9 a.m. 6 a.m., right? I like to sleep in sometimes. Uh, all right, so 9 a.m. because he likes to sleep in. Yep. But we did see something in the in the pond. I couldn't figure out what it was. I don't know whether it was a fish or a frog. They went swimming by. We haven't seen any fish. Oh, there goes one right there. Look at that. As I'm speaking about it, I don't know whether you could see it. It's a goldfish. So that's probably not going to get fixed this trip. Uh, I am working my way towards where the wasps were to see if there's anything going on this way. I want to, uh, I'm just going to wait a little bit and spray them real good, but I don't see any movement in there right now at all. I'm not seeing anything. Come on, Jacob, come over here and put your foot, push your foot around no, in there. I'm good. I'm come good. on. No, I'm good. No. I don't see anything at the moment. So I'm going to spray it again. We'll see what happens with it. But I'd really like to fix that this weekend, but there's so many other projects that need to be done, including I need to get a screen door for the back door. I need to put that up. Uh, that's about an, an hour project or so, but it's another hour just to go drive and get it. This fence will be done tomorrow. We'll get the rest of the supplies that we need. And then uh, we, maybe we can work on the bathroom floor. I need his help picking up the, uh, the, uh, the cabinet uh, with the sink and all and moving it out of the way. But this, uh, I think this fence will be done tomorrow. Probably gate included uh, everything tomorrow is nail guns and screw guns uh, we only have a couple pieces we need to cut and uh, the hardest part is going to be putting the fence up because uh, you have to cut every section but what do you got for me there what a what a day man <laughs> uh, where's i want you to look at them where's the sweat where's your perspiration at there's none 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 look at this look at my Right down. That'll show you who was working. All right. We'll see. Jacob will see you in the morning. Sounds good. So I thought I smelt gas the last time Stephen and I was here. And then I noticed there was a little bit. So I was going around trying to figure it out. And I couldn't find it the last time. But I'm pretty sure I found it this time. I tried tightening it and uh, looks like it's still bubbling. I don't know about this. I might have to call a repair person. That might need to be replaced. All right, so I tried to tighten the part that was bubbling and it wouldn't. So this is what it was doing I found uh, last night. So I just wanted before I shut the gas off and put it away see what it was doing so it's been 30 seconds already the glow plug is shut off but the burners are still on three minutes and it's still lit so I'm just gonna shut the gas off call for a repairman cook my steak got me a steak Almost like Krabby's family's coming to visit. I'm using the griddle to uh, sear this steak. And once I get a good sear on it, I'll drop it on the uh, barbecue grill, let it finish. Duh. Man, it sounds good. 
smells good too. Well, that steak was amazing. Amazing. It was like Krabby's family was coming to visit and she ran out and found the best ribeye she could. Delicious. Thank you, Krabby. But I'm sitting here now having a uh, Vakken cranberry. <clears throat> excuse me, a Vakken cranberry. Watching a Magnificent Seven. And I was sitting here editing video at the same time. And I'm seeing this video is getting pretty long. It's uh, it's like 25 minutes now. So I'm going to uh, I'm going to make this a part one, part two. Uh, I'm going to have it coming up in a second. We're going to have um, some video from the uh, game cameras that were out there. And uh, appreciate you watching. Thanks to all the new subscribers. Um, thanks for all the comments. I really do appreciate everybody commenting. Do us a favor, share the video, leave a comment. We really do appreciate the comments. Uh, like the video, give it a thumbs up. And uh, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe to the channel. We appreciate it. And uh, hope you enjoy the footage from the, video, uh, from the uh, trail cameras. And we'll see you next time. Thank you.